Hey guys, Topher Rocks back, and I have some Modern Warfare 2 gameplay here on, I guess, Vacant, and I think we lose, but uh, I'm not really going to talk about the gameplay. I kind of want to start a, I wouldn't necessarily call it a series, I guess, but maybe just like episodes, I guess, of um, Where Have You Been When series. And basically how this is going to go, um, I'm going to basically describe a situation and tell you where I was and when I heard the news. Um, of this situation and this week it's going to be 9-11 um, and that was a very impactful day and I'll never forget that day for the rest of my life and where I was when this happened um, I was in high school I was a freshman it was 2001 obviously um, and I remember I think I was in actually ironically US history class and a teacher came in and said that the World Trade Centers were attacked and someone uh, bombed the World Trade Centers is what they said um, and at the time you know there wasn't really too much information out there um, on exactly what happened um, then we got it clarified that uh, some planes did uh, crash into the World Trade Centers um, and that was just absolutely shocking and you know I was geez, 14 at the time which is crazy or actually uh, yeah I was 14 because yeah I turned 15 my freshman year um, in May um, late in the year but uh, so I you know I wasn't really into politics and you know I, don't, I didn't know why someone would do that and you know at the time I, I remember um, Gosh, I, I just remember, it, it's kind of visions uh, of stuff that you remember and just little things people said, but uh, that, that was such a crazy day because um, I remember just the rest of the day we were thinking, you know, are, are we going to get attacked next because we kept hearing later in the day, um, you know, the Pentagon got attacked as well. And uh, we thought that, you know, we were being attacked, you know, all over the country and um, we have a... Uh, McDonnell Douglas or now it's called Boeing um, where we build like military planes and stuff like that we thought we were going to be attacked for that in uh, in St. Louis so we were kind of scared about that and they were thinking about letting uh, class go early even though that's not really close to where our high school was located but uh, that was just a crazy day and we were all just speculating you know who would do this or is the government behind this or you know something like that and that was just a crazy day that I will never forget for the rest of my life um, unless I get dementia or, or something like that hopefully not um, but that was a crazy day and I just remember I honestly thought about joining the military because I wanted to help you know help the cause and you know stop people from you know doing terrorism and uh, of course I didn't join the military but uh, you know guys like Pat Tillman did and you know they and there's guys still serving our country, uh, you know, every day, putting their lives on the line, you know, protect us from, you know, stuff like that from happening again. And uh, I, I really wasn't a fan of President Bush, um, you know, at the time, and and uh, but he did make a really good speech. I'll admit, um, you know, I don't really remember exactly because I don't have that great of a memory, but uh, you know, it kind of pumped me up, and you know, I really think that event really did. Um, you know, kind of unite the nation for a time, and and uh, we we really did feel united. And I remember when, because um, sports, uh, I don't know if you guys remember, they took like a, a week off basically to mourn uh, for those who lost their lives there, and and uh, basically just just time for us to mourn and heal as a country, as a nation. And it was it was a rough time, but. I remember um, when baseball came back because I'm a huge baseball fan and uh, Jack Buck made a really famous speech um, he died the next year in 2002 so you know it was really nice of him he, he got up at Bush Stadium and, and made this beautiful speech about um, how our country was going to be united and stronger after this and uh, that's basically what happened uh, I think we're back to being you know pretty divided right now you know I'm not really huge into politics but everyone knows that uh, we're definitely not the most united nation anymore but at that time it was just it was such a great time like after of course after the horrible events of 9-11 how our nation did become you know you know we were, we were together you know we were Americans together and it was just a great time and yeah I was in high school when this happened and uh, it was pretty crazy so uh, 
Guys, leave some comments where you guys were when this happened, and I'm gonna try and keep uh, keep doing a couple episodes of these. Uh, you know, basically where you were when this such situation happened, and uh, yeah, let me know where you guys were when uh, you heard the news about 9/11. It'd be really interesting to hear, uh, you know, where people were and uh, how they heard the news. But uh, yeah, leave those in the comments, and I will talk to you guys later. See ya.